Sports on Air. Ellie helping out with the, the team in terms of being now no, the assistant coach. Sorry. Sorry, seven of eight. Uh, now that uh, LA is in the, is, is in the coaching staff and as an assistant, how is he contributing to the team this time? Well, it's it's more about just presence with LA and the idea that his players listen, all the players listen to him. So when he has advice to give, everybody stops and listens. Um, uh, it's it, you know he, he's not involved in the day to day that we is with the coaching because he's he's not always here he's doing treatments and coming back and so he's not with us 100 percent of the time. Um, uh, I think he's going to be there for game one. I think he won't be there for game two. Uh, I, I'm not sure the absolute schedule, but uh, like I said, he, he when LA speaks, everyone everyone listens and. Uh, um, and when he comes up to you in, a, in the middle of a game and, and says, you know, because he sees the game really well. He's been around, he's 38 years old, he's been around in all these kind of situations. When he sees stuff and, and, uh, and he t brings it to like Scotty or, or Stanley or even Justin, they listen. And uh, uh, he, he's a presence out there. Coach, um, if ever you win, this will be seven out of seven for Justin Brown already. That's an important seventh championship that will move him past Sean. Ready for most championships by uh, by PB import. Um, what do you think that will do for his legacy and you know his rankings among the the best imports? In well, I, don't, I don't. I don't think he's. I don't think this one is going to have much difference on his legacy. He's already secured his legacy, whether he wins or loses this one or not. Yeah. Um, and he's he's not going anywhere. He's 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 going to be coming back. He's going to have more chances. So. Uh, uh, even if he stays at six, he's still going to be one of the greatest, if not the greatest, import to play in the league. And that's saying a lot with the Bobby Parks and the Norman Blacks and the Tony Harris's and, of course, the Sean Chambers. It's, it's a lot of imports to be that have been here through our shores through the years. Can you imagine how many have been here and to be considered the best or at least one of the best? That's an amazing feat. Uh, Coach Jonas, uh, this is uh, Randy's first PBA appearance. PBA appearance, yet uh, he was able to help the team guide to the final. So, how big of an impact is he for you guys? As you said earlier, that uh, how is he a stabilizer? Uh, yeah, before I answer that, I just want to make a comment on on how I wanted to coach. Um, um, if there's something that I picked from from Tim, um, yeah, definitely um, the way the way Tim handled his players before. There's always that connection with the players. And the way his relationship was with me, even if off the court, we still had that relationship. In the same way with the players before. Uh, before, so that's what I want to bring to to uh, TNT about that connection with the players. It's it's a huge help in terms of um, the communication lines, you know, and um, that relationship. And that's what's uh, dif um, the di big difference with him is that. You build that trust, you build that relationship, and for him, relationships are really, really important. And more than more than the system, more than the defense, more than the offense, I think uh, the character part of, of um, running a team is, is huge for Tim. He just doesn't discuss it so much because it's been overlooked because of his triangle system, the way he runs his team. But the way he picks players, uh, that he wants to, to get players of character first more than, more than talent. Am I right or am I wrong? Thank you, Joe. There you go. Uh, well, for Ronde, I want to ask Ronde. Yeah, Ronde is going to be a big equalizer for us. And um, we, we like his enthusiasm, we like his youth. And, and he has a mission of having not won at any championship yet. So I'm just hoping that that can negate a little bit of, of Brownie's magic. Uh, um, could you elaborate your conversation with Sean Chambers? Uh, you mentioned uh, <laughs> Sean. Is he rooting you know. for you or rooting for Coach Tim? He's rooting for me, definitely. <laughs> but he told me not to tell Tim. Now no, he knows. No, no, I know. <laughs> I'm not surprised. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah. He, he was, and he was serious about it. Yeah. <laughs> he was really Sean, so I was, uh, I had a big laughing emoji. <laughs> yeah. So uh, how, how, how does it feel about uh, this uh, final series from from what you know? He's he's excited. He's excited, and he's he's really happy for me. He's not happy for Tim because he's been there a long time, you know. <laughs> but he's just happy for me, even if he knows that it's just a one-off for me. Coach, uh, just to follow up on Randy, how has it has handling Randy so far for for TNT? How has how has uh, the coaching staff been handling 
Ronde how has been responding to uh, the teachings of the coaching staff? Uh, he's been open. Um, our, our system is pretty easy and, and Tim knows our system too, in and out because of Gilas, because of Chot. They're running the TNT system. So there's no secret here in the same way that I know his system about the triangle and his tweaks because even before I was here, we've had conversation with him about his system. But sometimes he takes out the triangle, sometimes he puts it back in and sometimes he tweaks it. So I know, I know all the changes and, and Tim's uh, tweaks. So for me, there's... You know, there's no secret here. No, that's, that's why it's going to be hard. No, yeah, there's no <laughs> I keep secret saying here. that. <laughs> Coach Jojo, how are you currently handling Ronde's passing situation, especially at the Georgia Finals? Um, nothing. He's he knows how to handle it. He's been doing that for the last four years, so you know it's it doesn't really affect him. So I'm really surprised. You know, it's, it's finished you know, on yeah. Sunday, right? No, it's one month. So it started uh, March 22, ends April 22. Ends April 22. I thought it finished on no. Easter Sunday. No. Coach, could you describe your relationship outside the basketball court? Coach Tim, Coach Jonas, your relationship with each other uh, outside the basketball court? We see each other in Tally Beach. Right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, he lives in the north, I live in the south, you know, so it, it, it's not like we connect all the time. But yeah. when we do, there's a, there's a level yeah. of comfortability that, that, that uh, um, you know, you, you can be away for a long time and, we, and then we see each other. It's like yeah. right getting back right, right back at it again. So, uh, um, you know, th this is, I, I don't think I've ever been, maybe Chot, not even, not even Chot. I think I've never been this close to an opposition coach before uh, in, my, in my career. Jojo's the closest guy I've ever been. It's been another coach. Um, and uh, uh, the history is, is long and, uh, and, and, and the history was intense. We had some intense moments together all the way through our, our respective careers, uh, through player, assistant coach, and and uh, and then you know the the, the off the court stuff, and um, you know my wife still feels very close to Buchik, his wife, and uh, and we keep up on his kids, and he keeps up on our kids, and so it's it's a it's a really close relationship, and always makes it difficult to get into a. It's going to be hard to you know get mad at Jojo for anything he might do in a game and. I'm yeah. going to ask my players to trip your players. <laughs> <laughs> that will yeah. piss you off. Uh, but I mean, it's just, it, you know, it, 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 every, every win, it, it, if you do, it's going to be bittersweet. Yeah. And, uh, um, but, you know, we're, we're both going to have jobs to do, and we're going to do it to the best of our ability. And uh, there's going to be respect, I think, on both sides of the floor, but there's going to be really intense, tense competition. And... Uh, his organization really is hungry for a win, and uh, we know that and we understand that, and they've played like that all conference long. And uh, there's no doubt that 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 we, you know, there's there's going to be a lot of hunger in our team. I mean, uh, I think once you taste it, you want more of it, and uh, it, the, the hunger pains are, grow once you've tasted it. So. Uh, I think these guys are, our guys are ready to go, and I'm 100% I'm sure their guys are ready to go. It should be a great series, in many, on many levels. Thank you. Habang mainit ang mga laman sa ating mga paboritong liga, mag-register sa 1xbet. Pwede nyo gamitin ang inyong browser or ang cellphone mapa Android man o iOS. Gamitin lang ang inyong mobile number at huwag kalimutan ilagay sa promo code ang 1x on air. Kapag ginawa niyo yan, pwede kayong magkaroon ng bonus up to 7,000 pesos. Pwede nyo gamitin ang GCash account nyo para makapag-deposit or mag-cash out. Simple lang, di ba? Kaya mag-register na sa 1xbet. Thank you for watching. Click the subscribe button and ring the bell to be notified with our latest videos.